All right, guys, it is Fan Mail Friday again. We got a little stack of things here, a couple of boxes, handful of envelopes, and this one right here I couldn't ignore because it says, I hope I don't read the map wrong with my one eye. So we're going to start with this one right here. And this one comes from Eric in Albuquerque, New Mexico. All right, let's get this open here. We have bubble wrap. Oh, yeah. We got a whole box full of stuff here, guys. Give me just a second here, and I'm going to tell you what it is. Okay, we have a letter. We have two letters and some pictures here. So I'm going to read those first, and then I'm going to show you what all just came out of this box. Okay, let's start with this one right here. It says, Hi, my name is Odin. I love your videos, and I am too. I can say, holy crap, hot nozzles, <laughs> Johnny Punk. Heck Spawn, Leatherface, Heckles, Lil Skellybones, Dagger Mike, and Henry Hustles, and Slim. Okay, so there's the little letter there from Odin. Here's the letter that Odin wrote, and it's very light, and it's in, I think, a uh, colored pencil. So it's rewritten on there so that I can see what it says. And then we have a picture on the back here from Odin. If that will show you right there, it's a little bit light. Very cool. Thank you so very much, Odin. I love it. And then we have another one right here. And this one says, hi, it's a phone holder that I made for break time. And that's referring to one of the things that's sitting down here. Can you come to the Spirit Halloween near Cottonwood Mall in Albuquerque, New Mexico? And do Harry Potter Saturday Night Snack in a Movie? Me and my brother Odin watch you a lot. I am Eric, and I am 11. Okay, so, um, I know that I did film a spirit in Albuquerque, New Mexico this year, and I honestly don't know if that's the one that you were referring to, because I believe I only filmed that one in, uh, in Albuquerque. Um, and yes, I would absolutely love to do a Harry Potter movie night. So stay tuned. Make sure you're watching the Saturday Night Snack and the Movies, and one of those will be coming up with Harry Potter. So here is a picture from Eric. <laughs> Very cool. No, I do not want to read the map wrong. You have to have one eye. And then here we have Punchy saying bad words. This looks like Johnny Punk there. Yeah, it says, what are those underneath? Oh my gosh. Okay, so we have Mr. Dark and Hex Spawn here. Possessed Pumpkin. Um, let's see, we have Heckles. This must be Sam over here. And then what is that one there? You guys will have to tell me what this one is right here. Because I'm, I'm not sure. So let me know in the comment below what that one is. All right, thank you, Eric. I love your pictures. I love your letter. And thank you, Odin, as well. So I'm going to show you guys what came in the box here. We have a whole bunch of candy here. Look at this. We got Hubba Bubba Max bubblegum. We have, hmm, oh, it says strawberry gummy candy right there. We have an extra fine point. Must be a marker. Okay. <laughs> we have some boba milk chocolate, some M&Ms. We have mini iced oatmeal cookies. Yum. Skittles, more M&Ms. We got a blow pop, a whole handful of these. And then we have, oh, look at this. We have the phone holder here, right here. And it looks like it was 3D printed. Very cool. And it says, what are those right there? <laughs> Very cool. So you put your phone right in there to rest it. That is really cool. And then we have some more candy here. Swedish fish. We have Skittles. More M&M's. Peanut M&M's. And a giant lemon head. All right. Thank you guys so very much. I'm going to put this in the stash for movie night. All right. Up next, we have some letters here. We'll start with this one. And this is from... It doesn't say a name on here, but it's from Charlestown, Rhode Island. And it's a Halloween card. Very cool. And then we have a picture here and a letter. So I'm going to go ahead and read the letter first. Hello, Nate. It's Serious Moon from YouTube. I made a drawing of you with Ghostface's shoe. <laughs> 
I have a request for Saturday Night Snack in a Movie. Nosferatu, I think that's how you say it. Teen Titans Trouble in Tokyo. And Scream. And Happy Halloween, October 2023, to that Nate guy on YouTube, wishing you a happy, scary, spooky, fun, wonderful Halloween from Sirius Moon, the YouTuber. How cool is that? And then we have a picture here. Nate with Ghostface's shoe. <laughs> what the heck? Look at that. It says, what are those? <laughs> okay, next up we have one here. It says, Happy Halloween on the back. And this is from Christina and Stephen in Federal Way, Washington. Oh, it's another ghostly card here. It says, don't know what I'd boo without you. Look at that. It's a ghost in a tree and a pumpkin on the ground. Very cool. I love how the leaves are falling all around. Nate and Marion, thanks for being so wonderful. Happy Halloween. Love, Christina and Stephen. Thank you so very much. I will show Marion that card as soon as I go upstairs. Okay, we have one right here. Um, the Carly W Channel from Frankston, Texas. All right, let's check this out. All right, we have a letter here, and it looks like it might be an interview. Hey, Nate, hope you are having a wonderful day in Ohio. Is the weather starting to cool off? Yeah, this letter came, yeah, this letter came the beginning of November, so it is definitely starting to cool off. It's like 40 degrees out there right now. Are the leaves starting to fall off the trees? Are the leaves starting to change colors? The leaves have already changed colors, and they are um, com almost completely off all my trees around the house here. I am enjoying my first fall days when I am not going to school anymore here in Texas. Very cool. What are your plans for the fall and winter holidays? My plans are to watch the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade. That's exactly what I did on Thanksgiving. I have something on the envelope of something that will be happening sometime at the beginning of 2024. The Carly W. Channel team will be announcing Baby Willits number 17. What? Whoa. Not to be confused with that piece of artwork I sent earlier this year of a character named 17. <laughs> I now have two new additions named 19 and Nimbin. 19 started out at my neighbor Jeanette's house and she has a miniature schnauzer named Kenzie that barks a lot. Nimbin started out at my new neighbor Jada's house, and she has a Jack Russell Terrier named Jack and three dachshunds named Coco, Daisy, and Maggie. My ginger tabby, Opie, has been feeling sick lately, but we are loving on him as much as we can. Jack's, Jack's attack is doing good, but he is getting fat. Pearl, Pearl Girl, is very healthy for a six-year-old dog. Did you know that cats and dogs are seven times older than humans? and that bears are two times older than humans. The Carly W Channel team and I have some questions for you. Okay, so we have like a little interview here. So I'm gonna go ahead and read these and answer these questions. What is your favorite food? Whew. Favorites are so tough for me. I hate to choose favorites because first of all, it's just difficult to choose favorites because I love so much stuff. And also, I hate to choose favorites because I feel bad for everything that I didn't say was my favorite. <laughs> So what is your favorite food? I would have to say, man, if I have to say a favorite food, it probably would be pizza. What is your favorite color? Probably, man, I don't know. It's so tough. As soon as I go to answer it, I can't. Like, I love blue, I love green, I love orange, yellow, red, everything. So it's really tough to choose a favorite color. Um, I think I kind of lean towards green, but I don't know. What is your favorite animal? Wow, that's a tough one too. All these favorite things. <laughs> My favorite animal is a liger, a lion and tiger mix because he has skills. What is one skill that you have that makes you unique? I don't know if this can be considered one skill or not, but I'm able to figure out just about anything. If there's something that I want to do, I'm able to figure it out no matter what it is. Like, I know nothing about fixing cars, but I once had a car that kept breaking down, and so I had to just keep on figuring out how to fix it. And the craziest thing was like the serpentine belt. I didn't know anything about what a serpentine belt was, but I figured it out and I fixed it. And it's just like that with pretty much anything that I come upon. I can figure out anything. What are your favorite 
hobbies. Making videos and collecting garbage pail kids. In your free time, what do you like to do? Make videos and collect garbage pail kids. <laughs> I don't know, I like to do all kinds of stuff. Go to the movies, I do love to open garbage pail kids. I love to spend lots of time with my wife. We like to watch movies and go to movies together. We like to eat together. We like to order DoorDash together. <laughs> Have you volunteered in your community or have you done any community service? I have, but it's been quite a while ago. I'm usually traveling, so I'm really not home um, very much at all, at least enough to kind of dedicate to volunteering or anything like that. But yes, I've definitely done it in the past. What are your favorite things to do on weekends? Movies. If you could travel anywhere in the world, where would it be? Well, I would have said Hawaii, but I've been to Hawaii now. I guess I would go to Egypt. I've always wanted to go to Egypt and see the pyramids and things like that. What is your biggest dream or goal in life? I would have to say my goal in life is just to always be a good person, make other people happy, and figure out how to be financially stable for the rest of my life. <laughs> what is a family tradition that you have? Saturday night snack and a movie. Now, we don't get together for it all the time anymore, um, but when my kids were little, we always did Saturday night snack and a movie. What is a favorite memory you have with a family member? Uh, I mean, I'm going to have to say with that one, also Saturday night snack and a movie, because when my kids were little, we did it every Saturday, and it was a time that we always just set aside where we didn't do anything else. The kids weren't hanging out with kids. I wasn't working or doing anything like that. We always set that time aside and, and always had an awesome movie night together. Do you have siblings? If not, would you want to have siblings or do you like being an only child? I actually have a brother who's younger and a sister who is a little bit older. Which languages do you speak even just a little bit? English, and I took three years of German in high school, but I cannot speak it. <laughs> And if I'm being honest, it was because I skipped a lot and my teacher was the kind of guy who when I'd go in, I'd be like, hey, I want to go to the donut shop. You want anything? And he'd let me go. So there you go. <laughs> what is something that you are thankful for? I am thankful for each and every one of you who watch these videos and enjoy these videos because I make these videos because I love to do it. And without you guys watching them, I wouldn't be able to do this. How do you most like to connect with your friends? through social media, by talking over the phone or texting, or by meeting up in person. Honestly, I would have to say by social media because that offers the most freedom in connecting with friends. I don't always have time to get on the phone. I hardly ever have time to really meet up with anybody, although I did go to a football game last night with my brother and my daughter. Um, but yeah, definitely social media makes it very easy to connect with friends. And last, what are some things that you like to collect? Right now, the only thing that I really collect, aside from animatronics and Halloween decorations, are Garbage Pail Kids. I love all kinds of toys from the 80s, and someday I might start collecting all that stuff again. Transformers, GoBots, G.I. Joe, stuff like that. But right now, Garbage Pail Kids. I have thousands of Garbage Pail Kids. Okay, that's it for this letter, guys. That was a long one. Um, this is from Carly, Pip Squeak, Moon Dancer, L, Lucy, 60, 50, 40, 13, 36, Gladdy H, 18, V12, 5, 15, 11, Nimbin, Little Sandy, Humpty Doo, 19, Flinders, Coogee, Champer, and 26. Thank you very much. <laughs> okay, next up we have one from Old Bridge, New Jersey. And there is not a name on the front, um, so I'm going to have to see if there's one inside here. Okay, it says Nate. Okay, this is kind of difficult to read because it looks like it was written and then erased and rewritten over top. So I'm going to do my best, and I'm sorry if I mess this up. Dear Nate, I love your videos. Me and my friends Lucas and Jeremy really love your videos. My friend Lucas channels Halloween is goated. Halloween is goaded. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if I, I don't think that's right, but that's what it looks like it says. If you want to subscribe to him, anyways, here are some cool animatronics. Your fans, Aiden, Lucas, and Jeremy. And then there are some awesome pictures. All right, thank you guys so much. All right, next up we have ones from 
Ryan in Castleton, New York. All right, looks like we have some pictures here and a letter. It's stapled together here. Okay, it says, hi, that Nate guy on YouTube. My name is Ryan. I am 10 years old. I live in Albany, New York and go to Holy Spirit School. I have a YouTube channel called Rye Fry. You hearted one of my comments before. My family loves watching your videos together. My favorite holiday is Halloween, and my favorite animatronic is Mr. Dark, but unfortunately, I don't own him. I have a haunted garage party that I set up every year with animatronics and displays. The kids in my neighborhood love it. I own a 12-foot skeleton and a 12-foot witch. Very cool. Glad you like Halloween as much as me. Rye Fry. Check out my pictures. All right. So first we have a picture of hex spawn <laughs> very cool and then we have monty and the 12 foot skeleton here it is, oh it looks like um rye fry dressed up like wacky mole there and then we got a couple of dolls right there uncle charlie and hugs oh i see it says you're invited to ryan's haunted garage very cool okay and then we got a couple more pictures here that's the haunted garage we got the Fright in the Box inflatable there. Very cool. Thank you so much, Rye Fry. Okay, guys, we got three more. We got two more uh, envelopes here, and then we have a box here that is pretty heavy, actually. So let's do these envelopes first. This one's from Kingsport, Tennessee. All right, we got a letter, and we have some pictures here. Dear That Nate Guy, hello, my name is Jackson. I've been watching your channel for a few years now, like ever since I was eight. I am now 11. You are so funny and cool. Really like your personality. I like to watch your videos all day long. Please keep up the good work. You will always be one of my favorite YouTubers. Thank you so much. I drew you some of your favorite animatronics from Spirit. Spent kind of a long time. Please be careful with my drawings. I will. Please come to my nearest Spirit Halloween in Johnson City. It would be so cool to meet you. Sincerely, Jackson. Okay, so here we go. How cool is this? Oh my gosh. It's Crouchy with crazy hair. Look at that. Very cool. And then look who we have here. <laughs> it's Heckles. Yes, look how cool that is. I can understand why these took so long to draw. These are both very cool, and I will take care of them. Thank you so much, Jackson. All right, next up, guys, one more envelope, and then we got the box. And this one is from Bentley. Um, Port Huron, I think it says, but there's a sticker over top of it. Oh, my gosh, there's a lot of stuff in here. Okay, we got a card here first. It's Halloween, beware. But most of all, be cool. Look at that. <laughs> Very cool. Okay, we got some things that fell out. In other words, be yourself from Bentley. That's what the inside looks like. And then we have some stickers here. Oh, these must be tattoos. All right, cool. Look at this. This one says, who's next? And this one says, here's chuckles i think that's what it says and then we got the jason bear very cool all right then we have this book right here all spirit halloween 2021 i think that says oh my gosh how cool is this this is an entire book full of pictures look at this Pictures, 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 pictures. Oh my gosh. So very cool. I am going to go through this and look at each and every one of these pictures. These are so very cool. Look at this guy. <laughs> oh my gosh. Look at this one. <laughs> these are so cool. Thank you so much, Bentley. Okay, guys. One left. And it is this box right here. And this comes from Pat in Sutherland, Oregon. All right, let's get this open here. Okay, oh my gosh. Whoa! <laughs> Look at this. I'm just going to show you what it looks like right here. Look at that. So very cool. Oh my gosh. Okay, the first thing, because I cannot avoid it, is this guy looking out at me. How cool is this? Oh my gosh, a cool Jason mask. Wow. All right. 
Let's do a letter here first. There's so much stuff in here. Oh my gosh, this is... Whew, this is nuts right here. I love it. I love it so much. Okay, so look at this. It says, hey, you guys, <laughs> like Sloth from the Goonies. And if you guys know, I can't bend my arm, but you can kind of see I have a Sloth from the Goonies tattoo on my arm. So, all right, here we go. Here's the letter. Read live. I love that. <laughs> okay, it says, hey, Nate. Congrats on your 50 states of Spirit Halloween. I bet you have all kinds of travel stories. Oh my gosh, do I? In fact, let me just tell you real quick. I'm still editing and working on these videos, but on my other channel called Romancing the States, you guys can go over there and I have lots of videos, like 10 more videos coming that I filmed while we were out on the road um, driving around filming all these Spirit Halloween stores this season. And that includes the whole trip on the plane to Alaska and Hawaii and, and everything. And it's pretty crazy out there. We usually have a lot of things going on, including one from Colorado Springs where I was on these water slides. It was pretty cool. All right, I'm going to keep on with this letter. This Jason mask I painted myself, so it's not movie accurate. I'll tell you what, when I first took this out, I thought that looks like it was custom made. And now I know that it is, and it's very cool. In case I miss this live, I'll see it on the replay. Enjoy, my friend. You're very welcome. Sincerely, your viewer, Fat Pat. <laughs> P.S. Sorry. Wait. P.S. Not sorry, Reese's. Okay, so here's the letter here, and let me show you all these goodies. Oh my gosh. Okay, so we have this in here. What is this? Okay, it says the real goodie bag. Now, hold on. I'm going to look in here in a second, but let me show you this box. Look at this, guys. It is loaded with a couple of Baby Ruth bars. There are two baby ruth bars in here and then on top of that i think it's all reesey peanut butter bats look at this we have a whole bag of reesey pumpkins a whole bag of reesey bats another bag of reesey pumpkins another bag of reesey bats <laughs> Another bag with a mix, and this one has pumpkins, bats, and ghosts. And then there are even more in the box here. Oh my gosh, I love these so much. I am going to get so fat. <laughs> Thank you. All right, so now we have to go to the real goodie bag here and see what this is. I got to cut this tape. Okay, here we go. This is what was in the real goodie bag. Oh my gosh. Whoa, how cool is this? Look at this. This is a Garbage Pail Kids magnet. Come on, zoom in on there. Ghost Face Garbage Pail Kids magnet. And then we have an Atom Bomb Garbage Pail Kids magnet. Oh my gosh, so very cool. And a Goonies. <laughs> the Goonies. Garbage Pail Kid Magnet. How cool is that? Oh my gosh. I love it so much. And then we have another little magnet here. You Not All Who Wander Are Lost. And it's Bigfoot from Oregon. And then we have one more. And it's another Oregon sticker. That is very, very cool. And if you guys don't know, um, The Goonies was actually filmed in Oregon, in Astoria, Oregon, and I have a video on this channel where I went there and I filmed all of the areas that they filmed the entire movie of The Goonies. And that includes going to uh, California after Oregon to show you where they filmed the very last scene of the movie. Oh, all right, guys. Well, that was one heck of a fan mail Friday. So very cool. I gotta get out of here so I can get this edited and up so you guys can join in all this fun. This was so very awesome. And I just have to put this on a minute. I'm even wearing a Jason shirt right here. It says slashing through the snow. <laughs> all right, guys, stay tuned. Tomorrow night is Saturday Night Snack and a Movie. 
and uh, we have plenty more videos coming.